All right, what's going on? We are back with another video on YouTube. Once a week, I post every single week on YouTube. My last video did great. I wanna say thank you guys so much. It's like my most viewed, like best video so far. Um, appreciate that, it was my full sneaker collection. But for this video, we got something a little bit different. All right, so before we get started, I want you guys to subscribe, like, comment, everything, help your boy out. Um, I'm really trying to start this YouTube stuff, so uh, here we go. All right, so we're gonna be going over the top 10 sneakerhead slash high beast room accessories under $100. I know a lot of you guys want to make your room or your living room, apartment, your house, whatever it is, you wanna make it look a little bit cooler, give us some style, some pizzazz. Um, so we're going over top 10 high beast accessories under $100. Let's get into it. All right, so the first one we're gonna be going over is sneaker display. So you can use either shelves, your shoe boxes, or you can even use like the plastic drop front boxes and we'll get into it. Mm. All right, so the first is gonna be the shelves. Uh, these are from Ikea, actually they're about $70. I have a few, but for just one, it's about $70. And you can get them in multiple different colors, white, black, and they have them in like a wood finish too, depending on whatever vibe you're kind of going for but uh, they can screw into the wall or they don't have to. I live in an apartment, so I can't really just start drilling into the walls and stuff. So they do stand freely, a little bit wobbly, but they stand on their own. All right, so the second way that you're gonna uh, be able to display your sneakers is actually using the boxes. This one's gonna be free. I mean, I know the shoes cost money, the box, whatever, but if you already have the boxes laying down, it's gonna be free. Um, and this is kind of like a little DIY. So I'm gonna show you how to display your sneakers using the boxes. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do this. You're gonna wanna take um, all the stuff out of the box for demonstration purposes. I'm using Jordan 1 boxes too. It works on pretty much any box. You set the lid down first, or if you have a different one, you drop it down and you set it in there just like that. And then you grab your Jordan 1s right here and you put them just like that. So then what you wanna do is you stack other ones on top of it, take the stuff out of it again, and then you're gonna wanna set the lid down and then do the same thing right here. And then grab another pair of your Jordan 1s or any shoe, it doesn't have to be Jordan 1s. Go like this, set this one on the inside. And there's your second level. It's a little DIY for you right here. Put them in here, grab another pair of your Jordan 1s. And there you go. You can stack them up as tall as you want, but I'm just doing this to demonstrate. So here's this one more time. Grab another pair of Jordan 1s. There, go. <laughs> there it goes. Oh, so there you have it. You can set them up DIY all by yourself. You don't really need this, but this looks a lot cleaner in my opinion. But if you're on a budget, you can DIY and do this yourself. So your next item under $100 is gonna be skate decks. So you can get skate decks, bunch of them for under $100. I got this one for like $50. Um, it's a Supreme deck. There's a um, Supreme, Bape, Off-White, uh, Travis Scott. Everybody makes skate decks. Palace, you can get them on StockX, literally eBay, everywhere. Like you can get skate decks literally anywhere. Um, or you can just get basic skate decks at like skate shops and throw them up on your wall. Or if you don't want to drill them into the wall, I usually just set them in the corner. Like I have like a corner of my uh, living room and I just set it in there. But yeah, you can get skate decks for under $100 all day long. I got this one for 50, it's a Supreme deck. So simple as that. All right, so the next high beast accessory for your room under $100 is gonna be cereal. So. Cereal, I've got like Supreme Wheaties. I got these for uh, retail on the Supreme uh, site. I don't remember how much they were. I think they were like $16 or something like that. I don't know off the top of my head. I'll put it on the screen. Um, and then of course, the Travis Scott Reese's Puffs. I have these. I actually got these in Walmart. I used to work at Walmart. I got them in, like for retail, I guess, in the cereal aisle. Um, Travis Scott Reese's Puffs. You can probably get these for like 10 to 20 bucks online. Um, and these, the little Yachty ones, I have them too. I also got them just in a Walmart. Um, you can get these honestly for under $15 probably. Like pretty much all of these, like under 20 to $15 range. 
Um, I also have this, it's not cereal, but um, it is Mirakami water, it's like the Pierre water. Uh, I actually got this for retail too. I got this at Target. Yeah, you can get stuff like this. Literally, you just gotta keep an eye out. Like whenever they drop it, you can get it. Like it's really not that hard to get, especially the cereal items. They have a ton. Uh, they also have like LeBron James, Wheaties, stuff like that that you can get for really, really cheap. Uh, but this looks cool like on a shelf or like by a windowsill or something or on top of your fridge if you have like an apartment. Or I've seen what some people do on their sneaker shelves. They'll actually put them, instead of on the top shelf, instead of a sneaker, they'll put like an accessory up there. So that's another one you can get for literally under $20. Okay, so the next item under $100 is gonna be a basketball. So you can get basketballs under $100 for a whole bunch of stuff like Chinatown Market makes them. Um, Travis Scott has some. The Travis Scott ones are probably gonna be a little bit more than 100, but there is plenty of Chinatown Market ones out there for like 40 to like $60. Um, they look really cool, once again, on like a shelf or on like a nightstand, like entertainment center by a TV, stuff like that. It looks really, really good. Um, and you can pick up like, there's like bootleg Chinatown Market ones that have like Dior or like Louis Vuitton print. And it gives it that, they are bootleg, but it gives it that like cool, like modern type of vibe. So basketballs under a hundred bucks, you can't go wrong. They look sweet, like just gotta have it. All right, so the next item under a hundred dollars is gonna be wall art. So you can do paintings, pennants, posters, a whole bunch of stuff. I got this one done from a local artist, one of my good friends, Michael. Um, you don't have to get like a custom made painting. They have um, paintings on like Amazon, or they're, they're reprints, but they have them on like Amazon for like 20 to $30, if not less. I'll pop some up on the screen. Um, you can get posters for relatively cheap, like five to $10, you can get posters. They look good on the walls, everything. Um, pennants, you can also get very, very cheap. I have a vintage Chicago Bulls pennant that I have, I actually got it for $5. So you can get wall art stuff for like really, really, really cheap. You just use thumbtacks to hang them up. It's super easy, super simple. It gives your room like a whole new vibe. All right, uh, here's the pennant that I have. I literally got it for $5. You can get these anywhere from like five bucks all the way up to like $20. And they look dope. You just put them straight on the wall. It's super easy. All right, so next item under $100 is gonna be LEDs. I know like LEDs are like very, very overplayed right now. I get that, but you can get them for like under $20 depending on how long you want them. Uh, we have a few, they were like 30 bucks. Um, I think they look the best when they're like tucked behind things. Like for example, like we have some behind our TV, like they're tucked all behind the TV so you can't see them, but it's like it's glowing almost. And my sneaker shelves actually, um, we have LED strips behind every single one and they plug into the wall. It just looks like it's like glowing almost. Like you don't see them. It just looks like super clean and modern. I'll throw up some stuff about that. Um, like a video of it and yeah LEDs you can get them for like really really cheap I'll throw up some like Amazon listings or whatever right over here and um, yeah LEDs you can't go wrong all right so the next item under $100 is gonna be books so books you can get like relatively easy um, like this book you can find it at like certain Barnes and Nobles they sell them on like Kith they literally sell this off-white book anywhere um, I think it was like 60 or 70 bucks for this book and it's pretty thick. It has a whole bunch of cool stuff in it. Um, this book, there's like the ultimate sneaker book. That one's under $100. I'll put that on the screen. Um, there's like Louis Vuitton books. You can get under 100. Just cool like books. I know there's a dunk book too. You can get them for like super, super cheap and they look cool on like a coffee table or once again, like kind of by like a nightstand or like beside your couch or something. These look really good. Uh, nobody really reads them, but like they just look cool like sitting there. They look cool on display. Yeah, so hype beast books or whatever. They're fire. They look dope. All right, next item under $100 that looks cool is Funko Pops. So Funko Pops, if you don't know, they're like little action figure type things. A lot of people collect them. I'm not a Funko Pop collector. I just like the Michael Jordan ones. They look cool. I got Jordan sneakers. Just looks cool. Um, so Funko Pops, you can get them at like Walmart, Target, literally anywhere, like mall, like you can get Funkos literally anywhere. I got both of these at Walmart actually. Um, but if you can't get them for like retail, they're like 10 or $15 retail. 
Um, if you can't get them for retail, you can buy them online. They're probably anywhere from like 15 to like $25. I'll pop it up on the screen, some different like Michael Jordan ones. Um, they look really cool. I leave mine in the box, but if you take them out of the box, little action figure type things. I don't know if you can see it very well. This is the Jordan, like North Carolina, the UNC Funko. Uh, it's like a Walmart exclusive. But um, yeah, it just looks super tight. Like it even comes with a little stand on there for the guy to stand on. Um, it just looks tight, like by like a desk or on like an entertainment center or something like that beside your couch if you have a little stand. These things look super, super cool and you can't go wrong for like 15 bucks. Literally, you have to cop. All right, so the next hype beast room accessory item under $100, these are honestly under $50, is sneaker mats. So you can get these for relatively cheap. I got these sent to me, but these are like under $50. I'll throw some up on the screen. Um, this one's like a Jordan one. And I also have uh, two that say like kiss my airs, like uh, Air Maxes or Air Forces or whatever. I get a lot of comments on this. Um, I film a lot of stuff on like TikTok and Instagram in front of my setup. And I have a little uh, mat like this. And I get a lot of, lot of comments. Yo, where did you get the mat from? Where'd you get the mat? They sell them like so many places. They have a whole bunch of different like varieties. Um, like it's not just like words. You can get some with shoes on them. You can get like whatever you want really on them. Um, lots of people ask where I got these and they're super, super cheap. They just look cool. Um, they'd be cool as like a doormat outside your door or like on the inside of your bedroom as like a mat by your oven or like in front of your like bathroom sink you could put them down wherever you want um and they're cheap you could buy like four or five of them and just kind of put them wherever you want they're actually kind of comfortable too like they have like a memory foam in them and they're comfortable to like stand on so yeah that's why i have them by mine i think it just looks cool all right so the last item is how you display just one sneaker um so what they do is there's like a levitating sneaker thing i know you've probably seen this everywhere on TikTok, but you can get them for like really, really cheap. Uh, I'll put it up on the screen right here. Um, so what you do is you put your shoe and with a magnet inside of it, and then there's a magnet on the top of the little device, and it actually like levitates and floats and turns your sneaker. Um, you can get these for probably under like bucks. I'll, I'll pop up the price, of course. Um, they're super cheap. They look really, really cool. It's got like a modern vibe to them. I don't actually have one. I have something similar. I'll show you this. This is also under $100. It is this right here. It's like a little sneaker like capsule. So what you do, I'll show you. Bruh. So for how this one works, um, I actually got this one sent to me as well, but you can get them for like under 40 or $50. Um, how this one works is you like open the capsule and you put your shoe in there like this. And there's actually comes with like a fishnet. It's like a clear wire that you can't even see like with your eyes. So you actually put the little wire. There's a little hole in the top. You hook the wire to your shoes. You can't see them with their, your eyes and your sneaker just kind of like floats in there and it kind of looks cool. They have lights in them too. You can turn the lights on. I don't have batteries for it, but at night it looks cool. The whole bottom lights up and it's like a capsule for like your shoes. It's kind of the same thing as like the levitating sneaker um, display but you can also get this under a hundred bucks too. It's super easy. Bruh. Looks really cool when it's like dark and like moody. I don't know, it just lights up, it looks sweet. So there's the last item. All right, so that's it for the top 10 items under a hundred dollars for the Hype Beast room accessories. Um, I know some people are gonna be like, Chance, why didn't you do like off-white rugs? Or like the wet grass rug or whatever. Dude, that's like, <laughs> that's like almost a thousand dollars. Or some people might be like, oh, why didn't you do like an LED sign? Those are a couple hundred dollars. This is for the, the under a hundred dollars cheap, how to make your room look cool. So if you like this video, please drop a like, comment, subscribe, help your boy out. I've been really, really trying to do this YouTube stuff and it's very rewarding. I love you guys. You guys killed it on my last video. I know I already said that, but I'm just like excited. I don't know. Um, so yeah. If you love this video, like it, comment, whatever. Um, thank you so much. Follow me on all platforms. Chance Dubinick on YouTube, Chance C46, TikTok, Instagram, everything. And so I'll see you guys later. Peace.